When I think of Dogwood Canyon, the first thing I really think of is just the natural beauty of the Ozarks. Yeah. The dogwoods, the redbuds, the trees, the streams, the fish. There are so many ways to experience the beautiful nature here at Dogwood Canyon. I'm here with Shelby Stevenson, who's the public relations manager here. And there are so many ways to explore nature here. Yes, there is something for everyone to do here at Dogwood Canyon. So we've got an amazing, you know, education center and grist mill that teaches people about the heritage and the history of the property. And then it's time to get out and explore. And there are so many different ways that people can choose to do that. Of course, one of the most popular is walking or biking, the trails that we're on right now. It's a three and a half mile uh, one-way trail to the very back of the canyon, which is where we are right now. So if you make it all the way to the back, if you keep walking, keep biking, this is going to be your grand finale that you're going to come and get to see. Uh, and then the good news is, is the way back, it's a little bit downhill. So if you're on a bike, you're coasting the whole way back, you know, through, through these beautiful trails. But beyond biking and walking, we've also got um, a lot of really fun ways that people can engage with the canyon that are a little bit out of the box. So you can actually do Segway tours. Really? And get on a Segway and explore the canyon that way. So that's kind of fun because nature and technology are coming together in a really unique way. We've got an incredible stables facility where guests can do horseback riding. We've got one hour rides for people who are maybe new to horseback riding and then a longer two and a half hour ride for those who are more experienced. And those do some beautiful creek crossings and go through some ridges. It's just a, another beautiful part of the canyon to explore. And last but not least, you can also do a tram tour or a private Jeep tour. This is great, especially maybe if you've got you know someone in your family with limited mobility that they aren't able to do the walking or the biking, but they still wanna see everything the canyon has to offer too. Something that's great for all ages. If you've got little ones who can't make that walk, do a tram tour or do a private Jeep tour. That's going to take the same path on the way into the canyon, so you'll still pass all of those amazing waterfalls and creeks. And then you'll actually leave the canyon floor, you'll cross the Missouri-Arkansas state line, go up into our upper pastures where we've got herds of American bison, Rocky Mountain elk, longhorn cattle, and white-tailed deer that will come right up to the tram and you'll get to interact with this wildlife that would have called the Ozarks home over a hundred years ago. So it's almost like you're stepping back in time to the way the Ozarks was and really is being preserved here at Dogwood Canyon. That's right, and that's why Dogwood Canyon is under a not-for-profit foundation to ensure that this piece of land, with how ecologically significant and special it is, is protected for generations to come. Oh my gosh, I love it. And when you said the biking tour, is it? do you have to come with your own bike or can you rent a bike? You can rent a bike. You can either bring your own or you can rent a bike here from us. And of course, can't forget, you can trout fish here at Dogwood Canyon too. Oh, so you can actually do fishing here? You can do fishing and we've got, uh, you know, you can guide yourself or you can actually meet with one of our fishing guides and we'll show you the ropes of fly fishing. Oh wow. Now I noticed too on the tram tour, we passed by a beautiful chapel. Yeah. It is beautiful. Now is that for public use? Can you rent that for weddings or yes. how does that work? Yeah. So Hope Wilderness Chapel is just a beautiful little gem uh, here at Dogwood Canyon. We host over 50 weddings a year so it's definitely a popular wedding destination but when it's not in use for weddings it is open to the public so they can go in and experience the beauty and serenity of that chapel as well. There really is so much. Taking that tram tour is eye-opening to seeing the Ozarks, the beauty, yeah. uh, the streams, the different types of fish. It's overwhelming to think that everything is right here in our backyard. Right here. And I want people to take advantage of yes. what we have here in the Ozarks. Shelby, thank you so much. Yeah, Dogwood Canyon is amazing. I, all I want to do now is just go look at the fish and explore. I just want to go hiking now. Yes, well, let's go. Let's do it. Okay. All right.